Yes, we are going to become plant nerds today because this Saturday here at Dennis's 7Ds right here in Bridgeport Village at 1 p.m. You can go to Plant Nerdist, how to be a plant nerd. And we have Corey, the man, putting on this whole workshop from Potted Elephant. This is what you do. You actually grow the plants and people who come there will get to take a plant home that you have grown. Yeah. We um, have been growing in the local area for a couple of years now, and we sell to all the vendors all over Portland. And so lately we've been getting into teaching more workshops where we're able to get into the community and share some of the knowledge we've learned as growers. So what kind of things do people get to learn in these workshops? They, could you get a plant and it looks beautiful, but then oh, you yeah. have to figure out get into your home and keep it looking beautiful, that's where I struggle. Right, we're gonna learn how to ID plants, we're gonna learn how to water them, maybe potting up. I'm actually gonna show you how to pot up a plant here. Okay. Like, oh, you ready? Sure, let's do it. Let's yeah. do it. Okay. All right, so I grabbed a Lepismium cruciform. It Whoa. is a jungle cactus. I'm glad um, you said that. Don't try to make me say that. <laughs> so a jungle cactus, um, they're a really cool plant. They bloom and then the bloom turns to a berry and they keep this nice red foliage throughout the year. Um, so we're going to show you how to pot them up into a slightly larger pot. Okay. Um, so a lot of the times you buy a pot in a nursery pot and then you want to get it into something that's more aesthetically pleasing. Mm -hmm. I always go for terracotta because I'm a one plant, one pot kind of guy. Okay. Um, so the first thing we're going to do is pull it out of the pot. You can see the roots. We've got a nice root selection on this. And just to get it going, I'm going to break up the roots just oh. slightly, just so they're not going in circular formations. It's like a little plant massage. Right. <laughs> <laughs> then I'm going to put a little soil in the bottom of the pot. Okay. And I'm going to make sure I leave enough room to water, so that's about an inch down from the top of the pot. Oh, see, I would think, yeah, you just fill it all the way up at the top. No, no. you want it to sit a little lower. You want to leave a little space at the top, so that way when you water, the water doesn't go spilling out the top. And then um, you also just want to lightly tuck the soil on. You don't want to, like, push the soil in, because mm. roots need air, too, just like the top of the plant. Okay. So I'm just slightly setting the soil on, maybe shaking the pot and tucking it in. Beautiful. What did you call this plant again? Lepismium cruciform, or and jungle if, cactus. And if you do a really good job of raising your jungle cactus, eventually it could look like this? Oh yeah, totally. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. That's so beautiful. <laughs> so people want to sign up for the Plant Nerdist workshop this Saturday at one o'clock, where do they go? They go to my Instagram, Potted Elephant, and you hit get tickets, and it'll send you right to the link to buy one. And then you actually get to leave with a new plant? Oh, absolutely. Home? Amazing, so fun. I'm ready for my jungle cactus. I don't know how to say the actual name for it, but it looks so beautiful, guys. Back to you. <laughs> ah, when you can keep them healthy, plants are such a nice addition. The cactus, yeah, when you can keep when them healthy. When they start to grow, them, Kat, it's really sad. Them, right? yeah.